in Europe. I, was, I wasn't here. Uh, I've been five days in England and then five days with Uta and Helen in beautiful uh, in Paradise Uta's house in Germany. And it was such a strong experience, although I didn't uh, participate with visual, uh, individuals from there, but uh, I tried to, or I, I was pondering upon the different experience and feeling in the huge gap between being here in Jerusalem on the ground with the local energy and the local uh, circumstances of the time, which is very tense and you can't ignore it if you don't listen to the news or anything. You can't just ignore it. And to do this, uh, look at Jerusalem from abroad, it's a whole different experience. So I just put it here. I have nothing to say about it, just to share my, my feeling. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, Efrat. Back in Jerusalem, and we are here in the green. So it is quite mind-boggling, these, these different perspectives and what it is doing to us. Yeah, but it, it unites us to come together in, in this, on the subtle plane. And from there, together, we do the work. So welcome everybody and thank you for continuing this pulse every day, every, <clears throat> every week and throughout the week. Um, this sustained effort, keeping on, keeping on, seems to have, so it seems to me, I can feel the effect of it, continuing this, this stream of light and care. Thank you. So let us settle into our body now. Taking a few deep breaths, linking in with our inner silence. Our inner poise. Feeling our heart. Letting our mind expand. Expand into a silent spaciousness. And standing in soul consciousness. Reaching out to each other now from wherever we are across distance, bringing our love and letting it blend into our group heart, collecting it into our group chalice. And bringing our light, the light of our mind, into our group mind, creating a lighted space together. Standing soul to soul in the common work, 
in the will to peace. Taking a moment to sense our group as a fiery magnet. Being aware of our magnet being part of a network, planetary network of world workers. And sense for a moment this planetary force of the world workers, <clears throat> a growing peace commanding presence. We are coming into our conscious power. And with intent, let us take our place in alignment with the higher forces, with our spiritual co-workers on the subtle planes. Taking a moment to become receptive to this focused love and this will that holds us in stability. And taking this function as impartial observers, as silent watchers, let us now focus on the Middle East. And we visualize many other world workers from all over the world joining us in this work. We are a loving, caring presence, focusing our attention now on the location, starting with Israel, and with the occupied Palestinian territories of the West Bank and the Gaza Strip. Let us widen now our awareness to include Egypt to the south and Jordan to the east, Syria to the northeast, and Lebanon to the north. Getting a sense of this whole area. and expanding the field of vision further to include the other countries in the Middle East. And opening our awareness also to the influences of other nations upon the region. And taking a moment to just hold the complexity of the situation in our perception, just silently watching.
being aware of this huge field of tension and of all the parties involved straining to figure out what best to do. Focusing in on the thinkers on both sides and in other nations, those who work behind the scenes for a true solution. Based on our common humanity. See them being aligned with their souls with their higher guidance, being held in a protective space. Visualize these thinkers evolving the needed new ways towards resolution. And while the outer happenings continue as they may, let us see these new thought forms of solution slowly taking shape, gaining substance. To see this mental space, the mental aspect of the situation becoming lighter through the efforts of those thinkers, more penetrable to the light, to the energy from on high. Let us now, as silent watchers, take our conscious stand between the higher forces of light and love and the condition on the ground. And see and sense now coming from on high, a shaft of pure golden white soul light, broad and brilliant streaming through us as a group, pouring through each of our hearts and out onto the area of the Middle East. Let our combined soul light flood the whole region. And let us visualize that our soul light invokes the soul consciousness of all participants of this war, stimulating them, tracing a line to soul consciousness for them. Let us visualize the inhabitants move through their suffering, through their pain, towards soul awareness. And let us take a moment to accompany this process with our love.
Let pain bring due reward of light and love. See the soul light penetrating the mental space and now also the emotional space, soothing, reordering. And flowing through to the etheric and the physical level and down into the earth. Let's take a moment to hold this procession through all the levels, the soul light. Hold it steady in our consciousness. And see it doing its work. See the purifying, strengthening energy flowing through all the levels. Cleansing, healing, energizing, renewing. Let us keep our visualization steady, holding the soul light. See the old patterns slowly softening and disintegrating. And the forces of light gaining substance Visualize the seeds of a higher order slowly sprouting in the region from below, born out of the pain and out of everyday small sparks of light.
see a higher order based on right relations taking shape in the entire Middle East, bit by bit. And let us take a moment to hold space for this possibility. A renewed Middle East, based on right relations. Let the soul light now spread throughout the world as a blessing. Sounding a great invocation now in Hebrew and in Arabic. Let us radiate the possibility of a new day into the consciousness of the people in the Middle East. In a kudat haom, asher bedat el. Zrom haom, el dat adam. ירד האור על פני האדמה. בנקודת אהבה אשר בלב האל, יזרום האהבה בלבבות אנוש. ישוב מורה עולם על פני האדמה. מהמרכז שבו נודע רצון האל, תנחה תכלית את רצונות אדם. תכלית אותה מורי האנושות יודעים. משרתים. והמרכז אשר נקרא המין האנושי, ושם תוכנית האהבה והאור ייחתם הפתח אל הרן. יהי רצון ויחדשו אור אהבה ועוצמה את התוכנית על פני האדמה. אמן. من نقطة النور في العقل الإلهي ليشع النور في عقول الناس وليهبط النور إلى الأرض من نقطة الحب في القلب الإلهي ليتسرب الحب في قلوب الناس وليرجع معلم الكون إلى الأرض من المركز الذي تعرف منها إرادة الله لتقود الغاية إرادة الناس البسيطة تلك الغاية التي يدركها المعلمون ويخدمونها من المركز الذي ندون بالجنس البشري لينتج تسمين الحب والنور ويختم على الباب الذي يقيم به الشر ليجدد النور والحب والقوة التسمين على الأرض الله أمين